Hi. Uh, Hi. What do you uh, think about a, a full-service veterans hospital in Manchester? You know, for many years, uh, we've lacked a full-service hospital, and veterans have to go down to Massachusetts, the Boston area, for care. If you were elected, what would you do to uh, boost would, services in I Manchester? I would be a strong advocate for a full-service veterans hospital in Manchester. You know, <clears throat> both my father and my father-in-law were veterans in World War II. My father-in-law got all of his care at the Veterans uh, Medical Center here in, in Manchester. And we were very fortunate that his needs could be met. And at the end of his life, he lived the last three years uh, with dementia at the Veterans Home in Tilton. So um, our family is very grateful for the support that he received. And I want to make sure that all of our veterans and their families get the support that those veterans need. One of the reasons that I'm opposed to the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan is that I'm very, very concerned about the harm that's been done to our troops. Not only have we lost thousands of lives, but we have crippled so many people with devastating illnesses, brain injuries, PTSD, and these injuries are lifelong. They will be with us for years to come. So I absolutely will advocate for not only the protection and the support that these veterans need, but access to adequate health care at a reasonable location, which would be right here in Manchester. So do you think that a voucher system where veterans would be given a voucher to go to area hospitals would be an acceptable substitute for a full-service hospital? I'd be very concerned about the voucher for veterans in the same way that I'm very concerned about Congressman Bass proposing the voucher for seniors. Vouchers do not keep up with the rising cost of health care, and people do not have the resources to pay out of pocket. So I want to make sure we have a guaranteed health benefit for veterans and for seniors. Thank you.